Hello everyone, this is Dr. Ananya. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about thyroid stimulating hormone test and its results. Before beginning the video, I'd like you to subscribe to my channel so that I can share all the valuable and useful information with you. So first of all, let us know what is TSH test. TSH stands for thyroid stimulating hormone. It is produced by pituitary glands. Pituitary gland is present at the base of your brain. A TSH test is a test that measures this hormone. Now, let us see what is thyroid. A thyroid is a small butterfly-shaped gland present near the throat. You may use your two fingers to palpate your thyroid glands. Thyroid glands produce thyroid hormones. It regulates the way your body uses the energy. Along with this, it plays a major role in regulating your body weight, in regulating your body temperature, in your mood, and also your muscle strength. When thyroid levels in your blood are low, then your pituitary glands make more hormones. When thyroid levels are high, then your pituitary gland will make less TSH. Now, let us know what is this test used for? TSH test is used to see how well your thyroid gland is working. It is used to check the functionality of the thyroid glands. Now, why you may need this test? You may need a TSH test if you show some signs or symptoms of hypothyroidism and hypothyroidism. Hypothyroidism, also known as overactive thyroid, it means your thyroid is producing way much hormones. Let us see what are some symptoms of hypothyroidism. Anxiety, weight loss, tremors in hands, rapid heart rate, difficulty in sleeping, puffing and bulging near the eyes. These are some symptoms of hypothyroidism. When level of thyroid hormone is less in your blood, it indicates a condition known as hypothyroidism. Now, let us see a few symptoms of hypothyroidism. Weight gain, tiredness, hair loss, constipation, and irregular menses. These are some of the symptoms of hypothyroidism. Now, let us see what happens during a TSH test. During a TSH test, a small sample of blood is withdrawn from the vein of your arm. Then, this sample is sent to the lab, and results usually come in a day or two. So, how do you prepare for this test? For this test, you do not need any special preparations. This test is very simple and very quick. So, are there any risks related to this test? This test is safe from all type of risks. So, what do the results mean? High TSH level means your thyroid isn't working well and not producing enough hormones. Low TSH means your thyroid is producing way too much hormones. TSH tests can only tell the functionality of thyroid glands. It does not explain the reason why it is producing too much or too little hormones. For finding out the reason, your doctor might ask you to get additional tests, which include T3, T4, a test for Graves' disease, which is an autoimmune condition, and a test for Hashimoto's disease, which is again an autoimmune condition. Now, let us know what is the normal range of TSH. The normal levels of TSH in a healthy adult ranges from 0.40 to 4.50 milli international units per liter of blood. So, if a test report score is anything below 0.40 and anything above 4.50, it indicates that your thyroid isn't working well. Also, after this, your doctor might ask you to get additional tests done. It's sometimes easy to interpret your report by yourself, but it is necessary to talk to your doctor always. As a lot of disorders and diseases not only require your test reports, it may also require your previous health history. A quick reminder, it is very important for you to get tested from a reputed and reliable lab. A link to a reputed and reliable lab will be provided to you in the description below. That's all for today's video. If you have any questions or any suggestions, please feel free to comment down below. Till then, stay safe and stay healthy.